Strapping boys and girls, Dogecoin is in for a wild ride. So grab your popcorn for this video here today. It's, we're going to be talking all about Dogecoin, where it could go, the risks associated with Dogecoin, how to maximize your Doge profits, and what Doge rally really is signaling. This signal is what can make you loads more money beyond what you're making on Dogecoin. The type of money that you drool over when you see it, like when a Doge sees a juicy hamburger. So stick with me throughout this whole video and we're going to get through each and every one of these points. Before we get to that though, welcome back everyone. If you're new to the channel, it is all about making, saving, and investing money. The goal here is financial freedom earlier in life. Probably could have guessed that by that title of the channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I really appreciate all the support and it lets me know you're actually getting value out of these videos. So let's rock and roll. First up, if you're new to the party and have no idea what Doge is, 10 second explanation here. Don't go anywhere. We'll get through it really quick and then I'll get onto how high Doge can go very, very soon in this video. So Doge is a cryptocurrency based on a meme, this meme right here. And it was created, the cryptocurrency was created back in the 2013 bull run for crypto created essentially to make fun of the whole crypto space in general and pretty much how much of a joke it is. That pretty much explains Doge in 10 seconds. All right, so Doge is on a wild ride and you can see things getting even crazier out there. Currently Doge is in the 60 cent range and just was touching 70 cents this very morning. I watched it before my very eyes while scripting out this video, crazy. Seeing it hit 70 cents is crazy, especially since it hit that 69, 420 that everyone was hoping for on Doge Day. But hey, <laughs> we got there eventually, guys. But that puts Doge in the top five in terms of market cap for all cryptos. It's bigger than the companies Baidu, Colgate, Palmolive, Dell, Neo, and even General Motors. That's how big Doge has actually gotten in terms of market crap. Crap. <laughs> in terms of market cap. Don't go anywhere, the Doge predictions are almost here and we're almost to the Doge rally signal that can make you loads of money. So stick with me through the rest of this video and we're gonna get to those points real soon. Here we go. The exchanges are all rushing on board for Doge trading too. Look at this real quick, let me bring it up. All right, so right here, you've got Webull. They added Doge to their platform on April 20th for Doge Day. And then you've got, guess what? Gemini, the Winklevoss twins, they just added Dogecoin onto their platform too to get on the whole hype train. And even eToro exchange adds Dogecoin due to client demand. Everyone is adding Dogecoin. And if you look right here, Doge is in spot number four in terms of market cap at $83.13 billion. Mind blown. All right, Doge predictions are here. We're finally there. What you have all been waiting for. Well, maybe, unless you're waiting for the mouthwatering predictions at the very end. But hey, stick with me and we're going to get through the predictions for Doge really, really quick and where it could go from here. Real quick though, none of this is investing advice. I do not own Doge personally, but I am rooting for all of you who are currently in it. I think Doge personally, this is my opinion, that Doge can easily make it to $1 mark and it could even go past a dollar. Gets to a dollar, people will keep piling on. I'm pretty sure it's just, it's a meme stock. It's like GameStop, but it can't be stopped. Unless the exchanges start to stop trading of Doge, if you can't trade Doge anymore, because just they can't handle it, or this happens a lot during bull runs, is at the very top of trading frenzies, exchanges just can't handle the volume of people and the trades that they're executing. They just can't handle it and they crash. You saw it, you saw it yesterday, guys, guys and gals. Robinhood crashed, couldn't handle it, couldn't handle all the people and the demand going into Doge and the app and services were just, couldn't get into it. So that, that's a huge risk, and we're gonna talk about these risks very soon. Honestly, if Doge gets to the $1 mark, that would put it somewhere around 100 to $120 billion market cap in the number three crypto spot. That would be insane. That would be insane. But real quick, how to protect your Doge profits, and then on to the mouthwatering signal coming off this Doge rally. So protecting your profits is very, very simple and extremely important during any sort of massive parabolic run-up that Doge is currently having. This is not investing advice, but if I were in Doge, having a stop loss in place and trailing it up in X amount, so if Doge is at 60, I would have my stop loss at 30. Doge goes to 70, stop loss at 40. Doge goes to 80, stop loss at 50. And just trail it up as it goes up. And honestly, with a big enough stop loss, you're not just gonna get randomly stopped out due to the volatility of Doge. But it's extremely important because guess what? If a glitch happens and there's massive volume and just their app, their app, 
can't handle the volume of people on it and the app has a problem, if your order is already in the system, it doesn't matter if the app has a problem because your order is already in the system at Robinhood or at Webull or at eToro and they should execute on your trade even if the app is having problems. So hopefully they, they still can execute on it. And the problem when, when these exchanges start to have and start to shit the bed, you just can't execute any trades. And all you can do is just watch your doge, just, doge disappear, okay? And so protect yourself, have at least some sort of stop in there. Even, it's a, if, even if it's a catastrophic stop where it's like right at where you got in, it, it just have a stop in there and just be safe protect your money especially if it's money you you really can't lose and if you're if you're in doge with money you can't lose you should really get out of doge not investing advice but honestly it's very volatile and a lot of people will lose money on doge a lot of people will lose money on doge the other thing you want to do which i highly recommend is have a target or a goal and exit the trade just my two cents so if you're saying i think doge can go to a dollar man just get out at 90 cents all right don't be greedy just get out at 90 cents, and those are just my personal two cents. Now, the good stuff. All right, so the big mouthwatering signal that comes from the Doge rally, altcoin season is coming. From what I have seen is that Doge usually leads the rally for the altcoins. When you see Doge start to go, the altcoins are usually not far behind. All the smaller caps, all the sub-billion dollar market cap altcoins, they will usually start to chase after doge okay so the the mouth watering like 100 to 1000 x gains that you can get off altcoins and in, in the altcoin world that's coming it's knocking at the door once the dogecoin rally hits its peak altcoins will come because people will have gotten a taste they'll have made a bunch of money off doge a bunch of people will have lost money but all that money that comes out of doge will then go into all the other altcoins because people, they're hungry now. They, or they've just lost a shit ton of money so now that they, they have to gamble even more and they have to get into more altcoins to try and make up for the losses they just made in Doge. So it's kind of both sides of the, the gains and the losses will be seeking even more gains or trying to make up for the losses that they just had. So altcoin season, it's knocking, it's coming, so be ready. So this is what you should do. So be prepared to take advantage of altcoin season. It almost doesn't even matter what altcoins you're buying during the rally. They randomly pop off and crash all over the place. Be ready and have some dry powder ready to go. So you, you just don't want to miss it. This is like massive wealth building potential in the altcoin space. But it's also highly volatile and you can lose a lot of money in the altcoin space too. So be very careful. Do your research. Just my opinion, this is not investing advice. Now, with that, let me know what alts you're looking at. Drop them down in the comment section. I would love to hear them. I would love to review them on this channel and just give you my two cents on, on the matter and what I think of them. I'll give you my honest opinion, whether they could skyrocket or if they're complete doo-doo. But hey, <laughs> it almost doesn't matter in altcoin season if it's complete shit or not. Hey. Not investing advice. Again, I'll keep saying it. Not investing advice. This is just edu edutainment, infotainment, whatever you want to call it. Just my opinion. That's all, folks. Guys and gals, stay safe out there. If you're in Doge, if you're in any of the other alts, be very careful. Make sure you protect yourself. That's all I'll leave you with. I'll see you out there.